Good morning, I'm Francis Brennan, the presenter of At Your Service and Hotelier from Kenmare. I'm here in Cork doing some work today with the Irish Domain.ie because they have shown in surveys that only 6% of Irish companies, small and medium enterprises, use online for sales, which is incredible as far as I'm concerned. As a busy hotelier, I know exactly how important online sales are. It's not all doom and gloom though. The IE Domain Registry, who look after all the .ie websites, has launched their annual optimised fund for 2015 valued at €150,000. The fund, now in its fifth year, is open to applications from any small business in Ireland who wants to improve their online offering and optimise their website. So we're going to check with some of the shoppers in town to see do they shop online and to check with some of the business to know why they are not online. Do you ever shop online? Rarely, but right. sometimes. Yeah, yeah. okay, right. Hello. Very good. And tell me, why is that rarely? Well, if I do, I buy from local Irish Companies. Oh yes. Do you ever shop online? Oh, my daughter does on shop she online. Does. She does. What was the last thing you bought in Ireland? Can you remember? Oh, my misguided. Miss who? Misguided. Misguided. Yeah. If there was more availability of Irish companies online, would you shop online? Yes, I would. You yeah. would. It is me now. Don't get excited, all right? <laughs> Tell me now. I see you were shopping. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Now, do you ever shop online? Yeah. yeah. I got all the time. Today. What, what time of the day or night or whatever? Do you ever shop online? Usually, my mum was back from work. She's the money like. And yeah. did you ever shop online in bed? Yes. Yeah, we've all done we that. Have not so. together. Oh! <laughs> we have all the proof because we've spoken to the people and we do see that people shop online. And you know, people would shop online with Irish companies if they were able to. So the optimised fund which we're launching is ideally a place for those companies to get a .ie website and to go online and increase their sales. Leo, you have a trippy little shop here and I believe you have an online site. Yes, we do, yeah. We have... Um uh, site. We have it for a good few years now. It's, but now uh, listen, you can't buy on it. I would actually like to be able to sell online. Well, will yeah. tell you now. With, with the .ie domain, all right, and we're running our new right. optimised programme coming on now, fund, okay, you could apply and you could work with them to try and build a site that would be suitable for you. And it might not be as expensive as you think. Well, that would be fantastic. I mean, I would love for that to happen. Now, just in case you think it's only things like electronics that are sold online, traditional business, such as the fishmonger here, can also sell online. Now, tell me, you have a website? We do, we do have a website, yep. Yeah. And can I buy okay. online? You can't. But hold on now, I see smoked salmon and all sorts of products down there. They'd all be available online on a regular basis. They would, yeah, on a regular basis. Yeah, we do our all around smoking below. And would you not think of that? Mm -hmm. Good that idea, a huge, good idea, great idea, yeah. Huge sales in yeah, Irish smoked yeah. salmon and everything. Yeah. So you need idea. to look into that? Uh, yeah, yeah, of course. Now I did look, I was doing a bit of research yesterday uh, before I came up, and I saw a, a, a site called Plenty of Fish. No, no. No? No, not, not, not that kind of size, no. No? No, 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 no. no. Now, Christine, you're online. We are, yeah. And tell me a little bit about that now. So you can go onto our website and you can see the times that we open at and the kind of food that we serve because we open it day and night so the food changes is over. And have you any plans to expand on the website? We'd like to branch out so that you could order online your lunches and then for deliveries as well. Oh yeah, well, so you have a lot of things going on, yeah? We do, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and tell me now, when are you hoping to do that? In the next few months, so hopefully it'll be online soon. Very good, very good. Well, I think that's a wrap. Now my little jaunt around Cork this morning has shown me that consumers are buying online and we seem to be losing out to the big international competitors. So it's up to the small and medium enterprises to get out there, promote their .ie website and also all online sales because then they'll grow their business. To find out more, check out the Optimised Fund 2015 on IEDR's website.